Hi traders, here's a new video. First of all, the risk warning, your invested capital may be at risk. Don't trade with money you cannot afford to lose. And this video is not an investment advice. So this video is another live trading explanation video of those things which I have explained in my ebook. Get this ebook, it's for free. You'll find the link in the description. This ebook contains the most important candlestick pattern, chart pattern, binary option, turbo trading concepts, like candlestick mass, a rejection, market condition, trend identification, and last but not least, the mindset series. Uh, um, I'm working at the moment at the second edition of this ebook, but I need to cover some more uh, binary option turbo trading concept before I can publish it. As soon as I have completed it, I will make it available to you. So let me see if I can show you now some trades based of those things which I have explained in this ebook. Okay, look at this. This is this what I have explained to you um, on the in the um, uh, last videos where I talked about the Elliott wave. Here we have wave one. Wave 1, wave 2, wave 3, wave 4, and wave 5. Yes, and that is valid wave, and then you get a corrective cycle. This was the impulse, cy impulse um, cycle, and that is now the corrective. And you see the corrective is 1, 2, 3. And I'm going to do a put on the next candle. I'm going to do a put if this candlestick is telling me that we are heading down because I know that the corrective cycle is three A, A, B, C. Okay, so let's see. It has, it has not to go too deep, else uh, or this candlestick should uh, show me something to do this trade, else I will avoid it. So let's see. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm going to do a put now. Because I'm expecting that uh, this corrective phase, uh, this corrective cycle will go down further. And that's the reason why I did the put. Because I'm pretty much sure that uh, also the trend goes down. So uh, this is also in my favor. Because like I told you, here we have the inputs 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And the corrective phase here. And that is telling me that we are heading down. And uh, you see, we are going down. And that is how you have to apply the Elliott wave principle if you are able to spot this. Yes, you have to spot this and it will not work always. Yes, uh, um, you can uh, watch uh, this here. Um, uh, almost this is good to do. Something like this. This one, two, and uh, if it goes above this level, you have the three and you can enter into this trade. Yes, now. It should be again some other trend cycle because uh, all we have to wait till this will uh, stop and then uh, we can uh, apply this to another uh, trending cycle. Yes, and uh, okay, you see here there are some other which are not working so well. Yes, uh, but this was now an example of how it works. And you see the correction phase, the correction cycle worked out also good. So this was uh, this. I will uh, look if I can show you now some other trade. But uh, important for me what to show you uh, because I got a question uh, from somebody in the uh, in the comments uh, who wants from me that I show him how to use the uh, Elliott wave principle in practical on the one minute chart. And this was an example now here. One, two, corrective phase, two, three. Four is a four, a wave four. Okay, I have to open the door. One second. Okay, I'm back. Uh, I have to stop this video now. But I want to show you first, uh, before I go again, uh, what I uh, tried to explain you here. Uh, so um, let me show you this. The one, two, three here of the Elliott wave. So this was a live trading example of the Elliott wave. You see wave one. The wave two was a corrective. The wave three is also an impulse wave. And the wave 4 is also a corrective. And uh, you see this here. Yes, impulse 1, the 3, yes, and the 5. They are all, all impulse waves. And this here is the corrective wave. Yes, this is a wave 2. And this is also a corrective wave, uh, uh, also the wave 4. Yes, and after this, you get this here. You get here this kind of, um, of corrective, corrective 1. To A, B, C, and I will show you this also again here. A, 
B, C. Yes, you see, this is a corrective phrase on an uptrend. Yes, on a downtrend, it would look something else. Yes, uh, and uh, this is what uh, things about. You see here also that the, the, this uh, three is not the shortest. Yes, the wave three is not the shortest because the fifth was the shortest. Yes, this was the shortest, and this one has also is, uh, is some. This is an ending, a ending impulse wave. Yes, there are leading. Yes, and the ending. Yes, and uh, there are so many others, but this is doesn't so it doesn't matter so much. Yes, because you see, it will not happen often that you get something like this, yes, but if you can recognize this, you have an advantage, yes. You could, for example, uh, do, for example, this trade here, yes, um, here, uh, this one, because if you break through this, this is also elliot wave, yes. It says the point, the wave 2, this wave here, doesn't break, uh, doesn't have to break below this point 1, yes, I can show this now again, here, this wave, corrective wave 2, has not to go beyond the start of the wave one. This is was wave one. In this example, I can show you this. It was this level, yes. If this level don't go, it was already the first rule met, yes. And then the second rule was the third wave is never the shortest, yes. They can they do nothing, but uh, you could always uh, enter here with, with after this one. And the fourth wave, and the th third rule was the fourth wave doesn't go um, uh, or doesn't penetrate or regulate or something the first wave territory that was this territory here so and that is what the ending wave is about and you can and this is why i have explained you to this because the edit wave is always um, you can apply this in any time frame and if you want to practice this you can change also to the five second chart and on the five second chart you will find a lot of valid edit waves uh, principles uh, things yes that you um, can apply this obviously it's not always so off uh, um, so clear to view here like this one yes this was really clear to view and this is the reason why i have created this one A B C yes I was sure that this A B C would go out because the most and that was also the zigzag this was the zigzag here yes uh, um, which uh, which was this A B C baby yes uh, I, to be honest I am not so I use only that part what I know from uh, the binary option turbo trading yes um, I'm not uh, I didn't uh, read this book this, this uh, Pretstar Pretstar uh, Elliott Wave principle book I didn't read it I have a uh, uh, get this uh, by my own by doing uh, watching some videos and uh, 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 reading some books yes and uh, so um, as I don't uh, I'm not uh, also an Elliott Wave uh, trader or Elliott Wave specialist but I know what I can apply to my tra trading style and I know what I can apply to my one uh, turbo trading style all all concepts there are some more more concepts like the timing concept yes uh, which uh, says if you in a ratio for example from uh, of um, the ratio a golden ratio of 61.8 the, the price will do this and and so on yes but there are so many things but i can, i know those things which um, appear on um, on um, binary option turbo trading, those things I know, yes, and if I can find some kind of uh, uh, use of them, I will teach you this too, yes, uh, because uh, all those stuff is important, you see, this was a trade now, which was based on Elliott waves, yes, and, uh, uh, and if you, the more you know, better it is, so I would say this was enough, I have to go, uh, um, so I would say, um, if you like this video, do a like, if you didn't subscribe, subscribe, and if you have something to say, let me there a comment, um, so uh, stay safe and bye-bye.